Hello, um, welcome back to Dark Tale 3. This is Jay Rodman, and uh, we're in the middle of exploring Unterbray 3. Third level of the second dungeon under Scarabray. So far in this dungeon level, I haven't found... Well, there was the interesting thing of this crappy room they dump you in with lots of spell drain um, and hit point drain and other awfulness. There was a clue about a third ward, which makes me think there'll be information about other wards as well, because where's information about ward one and two? Anyway, um, so... <laughs> Let's cure this poison I didn't notice till now. Okay, and more we're into more boxy rooms. Looks like more two by two. Well, no, not not exactly. Seems a little more regular. Okay, so wing demons we found out were were really bad. Uh, marrow suckers, I don't know about. So I guess I'm going to attack the marrow sucker because I don't know if it's dangerous. In fact, I'm going to use a death strike on one of the winged demons. So their breath attack doesn't do that much. It's like 12 or something. So I don't know what they did the other time where they were hitting me for... 50. There's the death strike. Hit something for zero damage killing it. It's just a... If it works, it works. It can do like two damage, I think, and be resisted, but that's kind of not working. It's not really doing meaningful damage to anything. It's a, just a very large chance of instantly killing whatever it hits. Poison Needle. Oh. I think an adamantium or adamant D tight whatever. I think that's an upgrade. Of course, I already forgot who picked it up. It's like a design error in this game. <laughs> there should be some kind of like loot screen, but I guess the whole idea hadn't been invented yet. They were probably on the schedule. Okay, uh, Grisnak is going to take a shield upgrade if possible. Try to get rid of this gem. Okay, so our armor class is 11 and it goes to 13. So that means this shield must be at best a tower shield. It's a shield I got early and never identified. I think I still have some people using bucklers, so this is uh, my monk who cannot use this item, which makes me 
pretty certain it's the tower shield. Bard is already using a Mithril Shield, and it's probably only one better. Yeah. And I don't think my rogue's gonna be allowed to use it. Indeed, so I'm throwing it away. Goodbye, unidentified shield. You served me well. I just identified it as a tower shield, mostly because it was one better than a buckler, to my memory. But we got a bunch of other pieces of confirmation right there. There's the... okay, there you are. Something to the far right, maybe a wall, maybe a door. The horizontal lines make me think it's a door. Yep. And north is still a door, and to the east we have three walls on the north and two walls on the south after a gap. Stepping west, I get an inconsistency, which is partly why I did it. I wanted to, like if you go two different ways to the same spot, you oftentimes find out you made an error. And here, it looks like the error was in the room that I died? Really? I mean, I know that it is, but I was sure I walked, maybe I, it was just three long and I didn't notice. Seems like that's the deal. Okay, corruptors and marrow suckers. I still don't have a firm idea what the marrow suckers do. The corruptors hit me. So I'm raising my armor class, or lowering, whatever, improving, improving my armor class. That spell was pretty effective. Okay, so they're summoning. That's one trick the Marrow Suckers have that I didn't know.
Vortex. I wonder what a vortex trap is actually like. Like, is there some water that comes out and spins around? I really have no idea. I don't really want to find out, I guess. Okay. Put it on this corridor. Oh, an acid bath. That sounds more appealing than it should. I'm starting to get really ready for the sorcerer levels. We'll see why. No reason to spoil it. One, two, three. Okay. Door to the east and the north. Let's go north first. It feels like the uh, dead end space. zigzag. I kind of end up with this feeling of anticipation when there's like all this pathway leading somewhere. Like surely there has to be something at the end of it. It's not true, but it doesn't have to be. A lot of empty space in Bard's Tale dungeons. Uh, I have no idea what to expect from these guys, so I'm gonna start with some armor. But I think the Death Lions will will just claw us. But I'm sort of more concerned about the bone acolytes. So I'll give them some group damage and... Oh look, they <laughs> Deathline's casting spells. Why not? So the bone acolyte didn't do anything because we were too far away. Which means I definitely should not advance. Uh, but they used what looks like a shock sphere or something similar, which worked. And I'm kind of low on hit points, so it's time to do a heal everyone of all damage next turn. I'm doing a. I'm starting going to try to stack, start stacking up healing songs on the bard because. Uh, at the total rate of incoming damage there. It might be a bad scene if I have to keep healing all the time. Okay, Griselda, get your spell out before people die, please. That would be great. There we go. Everyone has full hit points. For now.
So they seem to be capable of kicking out about 40 damage a person. If they want to. Per round. I forget how much... my bard's tongs do at this depth. For interest sake, I'm gonna use a sanctuary score and watch this minus three. So that's four points. So each time I use a bard song, my healing received per round for free, a healing bard song, will increase by four points, which means 10 casts to totally negate the danger. Seems a little excessive. But then again, oh, my rogue finally got to the distance to try to stab them. If they keep summoning fire elementals, I haven't got much of a choice. Well, I could use ranged spells. They just don't seem to be going down to them. Okay, uh, advancing. I don't think that's crippling. I'm going to keep on advancing. I guess I'm now worried about Elena, so... Uh, okay, that was a mean spell. They stacked up two of those, I'd be in real trouble. Oh, Hop Blossom just took 60? Oh my goodness. I think I'm gonna lose her. Yep. Okay, that was a misjudgment. But I'm not gonna let these guys get away because I'm pissed off at this point. Uh, but I don't think I can stay, afford to advance. So defend, defend, more healing, attack them. Specter touch. So I think that's the best I got for a single target. And rest. Not enough spell points, of course. Which means defend. No, I'm not using those commands. Defend, defend, defend. No. Attack, attack, healing song, attack, flesh anew, and use a gem. Well, the fire elemental is good because it means he's not doing shoot. Okay, I guess it's time to run. Let's see if I get to run. Run. Nope. Okay. No more healing songs.
You are not my mage with restoration. You don't have Ice Storm either, do you? I guess I should have just, if I wanted to win this fight, I should have stayed out of range of their meaner spells, because I think that's what was happening. And built healing until it was insane. Whatever, I'm not going to advance. Because I'm basically dead no matter what at this point. I'm going to just try to take them out with me. Attack, Bone Acolyte, and Hide in Shadows. I think at this point I basically quote unquote win because I'm pretty sure my rogue will never be hit. If the rogue's hidden, I think they won't attack her. And if she's not hidden, she hides before they get to move. Oh, let's just open it up and see what happens. Well, Vortex. Vortexes do 20 damage, I guess. Okay. I don't think it's possible to get out of the dungeon. But for now, I'm going to map where I am. There's a note. Things that work this is capitalized in shadows below oh it's like couplets make or it's more like Irma shave level rhyming So here we have something about a first ward. Things that lurk in shadows below make it an unsafe place to go. That doesn't sound like it's telling me anything, except for maybe that there's shadows. First ward, spin lest ye be spun. So something about spinning, I'm expecting spinners. Don't really understand what I'm supposed to, what I'm gonna, you know, whatever. I didn't really understand what I was gonna do for the first clue either. That was for the third ward. Okay, so if there's a way out, I'm assuming it's something like a back way in to get to these stairs. So for kicks, we can... We can see if there's a, a, a route that we can find to over there. Oh, I just got turned around. Is there a spinner here or am I just dumb? I'm probably just dumb. Okay.
move this little marker. Hmm. This does not feel auspicious for the goal of departing. Wait, what am I looking at? Okay, so I drew a map for facing south when I was actually facing west. I have no idea how I ended up facing west. Auto map, meanwhile, tells me these exist. I don't remember seeing them. So I can see it now. Okay, can I go through this wall? Nope. And I was wrong about this. The only interesting thing I found just there was the explosion mark. Where's the lightning bolt marker? It's right in front of my face. Mm. Okay, but what about if I go... Oh, this... There's a wall here. at least from this side. And looks like walls here. So this idea of getting back to the stairway, I don't think it's happening. At least not as easily. Okay, let's go in here. One, two, look like. Before I get to this bit of wall, let's run away from those. To the left, there is. I'm surprised I can't see the outer wall here. Maybe it's just, you can only see one to the side. Okay, there's a trap here. And a fight. Okay. 
and another explosion. Here, I think. Okay, so I found my way to next to the stairs from two directions. And uh, no way to them there. So the other place that would be next to the stairs is here on the opposite side because of wraparound, although I don't feel like this dungeon is going to do wraparound. Oh, and of course, uh, the compass has expired. So getting navigating is getting a little trickier. Uh, it just gave me a clue and, and then it erased it because I pressed a key. So if I press enter and try again. Oh, that's that's better. We have a figure appears and asks. I have no lips, yet my kiss is deadly. That's no wait, I wasn't done. Command enter, whatever. Some enter that doesn't enter. Uh, I am not a razor, but those I caress never need to or needs never shave again well like that's not what a razor does anyway your best friend i will kill you the razor thing like, has me thinking along the lines of well i mean this sounds like something sharp you know the kiss of a uh, blade so i think it sounds like a razor but he says he's not a razor I don't expect to be killed by a razor. This is a fantasy game where people, so I think maybe sword. Oh, speak my name then ready me. Yeah, it's a sword, isn't it? Okay, so I got that right. What happened? Speak, name, then ready me. Oh, we got a we got a door to the left. I'm gonna just draw it as a door because I don't know. Okay, and then we have a hole going down. Which is not really where I intended to go, but it's telling me that's the only way to get out. I think it's probably not joking. The three wards below will try your soul, but that's the only way. Out of this hole, Yo, Hasty is cold and he is mean. Make sure his who are, his death is quick and clean. Who's who's writing these words? Like someone, there's like I could sort of suspend my disbelief with the random clues lying around, but this is just some text going like, "Hey, the boss is downstairs. Kill him." Go for it. And I'm like, what? Um, 
Okay, so where's uh, what am I going to use for portal? I think it's just going to be the ladder. Seems misleading, but I don't see a better icon. So uh, I don't even remember how to descend. Is it D? No. Is it W? I think it's W. Yeah, that's like a really unintuitive. Uh, e goes up and W goes down. Um, I have no idea why. They're just like in the corner of the keyboard. Okay. I feel like it's time to commit suicide because there's no way that I'm going to make it through and beat the boss of this dungeon with only two party members alive. I guess I could try to figure out what's going on here, but it just took, did it take away my light? No, it's spinning me. I see. So they did say spin lest you be spun is what is the deal for this level, but I don't know what that means. Let's start writing down where the spinners are. One here. And there's one here. I guess I could just follow the wall. I mean, why won't that work? Okay, wall on the left, please. Yeah, there we go. Something like two more. Okay, please give me a wall on the left. Another spinner, and at this point I can see there's a gap in the wall. And a note. Now I don't have any light. Diddly D? Diddle, diddle, Diddle D. Brave Blood Sheep. What is a brave blood sheep? I don't even know which way I'm facing. <laughs> I mean, I could step forward and then ask the auto map. Okay, I, I went north.
Uh, I went north and the map shows a line. I don't know what that means. Probably some kind of like one way wall or invisible wall. But I can't see anything. Oh, I'm finding some traps. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to let myself die at this point. Fight. Attack, 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 attack. Okay, so... Um, getting, losing the mages in level three or lower basically screws you because you can't get out. Um, I did insert my character disc. I, uh, it's, I, it's, oh, you're right. <laughs> okay. No, this time I really inserted my character disc. It does some kind of like slow polling, so it's like thinks it, it doesn't know the disc has changed until like a couple seconds after the disc has changed, and then it doesn't actually check when you tell it to. It seems kind of dumb. Anyway, here's death. The last your party has expired but gone to adventure heaven. I press a key. And it takes me to the, um, what's it called? It's telling me again? It takes me to the refugee camp. And saves them all dead. Just, you know, just in case you were not clear about what, what the scenario was. Okay, so... Um, I'm going to remove, I think Griselda is like the least essential. No, uh, Alindor, because Griselda has the, the heal everything spell. Okay, and then we're going to add one of my pointless characters. That's no equipment at all, just a bunch of gems. And run over to the shrine. Okay, heal. We're going to heal some meat shields. Chantrell is not a good meat shield. Oaken shield. Griselda has the money. I keep they're all out of order, so it's a little confusing for me. Uh, Griselda needs to be alive to heal everyone else. Uh, Hop Blossom should be alive. I'm ordering them so if I run out of money. Like, the ones I really need to be alive will be so. Okay. Everyone's alive but Elendor. Uh, cast. Restoration. Not a spell point. Oh, just, just use a gem. Damn it. Pardon my language, I might excise that. Cast. I mean, I don't really care about profanity, but I don't know if my viewers might, such that if they exist, they probably don't exist. I have a viewer. Uh, he might care, she might care. I don't know that person's gender. Okay, uh, cast. Restoration before you get in a fight and everyone dies, damn it. Okay. 
New Order 614523. Okay. Run away. I'm going to drop gems off at the camp again. Thank you for carrying six corpses to the temple. That was impressive. Add Eleanor. Okay, last corpse. How much money do I have left? A lot. Wow, I could I could have that happen again and it would be fine. Okay, uh I mean not really what I want, but okay. So now that we're up again, I'm going to save. Wait, I don't even know which way I'm facing. Okay, I mean, I guess I could have read the text on the screen that says facing cardinal direction. But at this point, I'm pretty programmed to look at the compass part of the screen to see where I'm facing. And if it's not there, I got a little disoriented. So although that was not a adventure that ended with great success, I do want to see where we stand on experience. God damn it, I need to use the bard song that makes them stop hacking me. Safety song. So supposedly, I will not have random encounters while this is playing. Not because I'm afraid of them, but because just go away, please, while I'm you're wasting my time. The survivors of that fight got ten thousand experience, but I think I look dire that people who died got nothing. So we're more than halfway to the next level, which I think is 14 for most characters. Uh, Mage got the first level, but this level is not um, the big one. Presumably better arrows. That's sort of what I'm thinking about them as. Okay, so no one has any upgrades. Uh, time to stop. See you next time.